Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at the latest Walmart mystery box. We've got the mystery box with two booster packs and one collectible pin. This is a new one that I haven't seen before. Um, it's got legacy packs seated one, two, and then they've got uh, the special edition pins, the official pin club pins allegedly uh, within the packs. Um, we've got five of them here. Um, but before we get started, I want to mention that we are going to give one of the five boxes away to one subscriber. So, uh, just be subscribed, leave a comment, let me know what you think about these pins. Do you think they are a cool collectible item? If they are actually the official pin club licensed ones, that'd be really neat. I think that'd be a really cool item. And if legacy packs are seated one too, I think that's a really good um, ratio. Uh, that means that at least two of the boxes here should have... Uh, legacy packs in them uh, so leave a comment below be subscribed we'll give away one box to a subscriber uh, and uh, hope you get it uh, and then let me know what you get as well so make sure you enter the giveaway so let's get into these see what we get like I said you get one of these pins and two packs they do retail for $15 uh, or just shy of $15 at Walmart um, you know, your targets, whatever, pick these up at Walmart. It's one of these MJ holding boxes. Uh, they show IOC and Duelist Alliance on the front, Dark Crisis and Flames of Destruction uh, on the back. Uh, one of the only mystery box things that I've never seen, uh, Legend of Blue Eyes uh, on the actual box. That's odd. Normally they put that up there to get everyone to buy it. So we'll bust a few open, see what we get, uh, and see what uh, actually happens. And uh, see if these pins actually are the uh, licensed product. So let's get the plastic off and see what's in here. Hopefully we don't get trash packs because uh, that would be the basically all the, the value lost. Who knows how much these pins actually are worth nowadays. <clears throat> Oop, these open on the side. All right, so our first pack, we've got Maximum Crisis and we've got Dimension of Chaos, so not terrible packs. And then we've got a, we got a Dark Magician pin. So it's Dark Magician stuff. Dark Magician's always good sought after items. So let's see what we get from our two packs here. All right, good. It's not any of these like seven card packs, uh, the, you know, collector rare sets. We'll just go straight through. We got Super Heavy Samurai Drum. We've got Super Heavy Samurai Soul Claw. We've got Ignite Veteran, Pot of the Forbidden, Toon Barrel Dragon as a rare only here. And then we got DD Savant, Raid Raptor, Skull Eagle, and Super Heavy Samurai Soul Horns and Fluff All Wings. All right, Maximum Crisis. Never had much luck here on this set. All right, we got Speed Droid, Malicious Magnet. We've got Magician's Left Hand, Lyralusk Sapphire Swallow, Phantasm Spiral Crash, and Fairy Tale Luna as a super rare. And then Ariel Priestess of the Necros. Wraps us out there. So didn't hit anything big on the first two packs. We'll open up the second box here, see if we can get this one open a little bit easier. That'll do us better. Pack-wise, we got Flames of Destruction, which is on the actual box there. And we've got Soul Fusion. And then our pin is another pin club one. Oh, and we got blue eyes. So we've got the two on the box, shown on the box, a blue eyes and dark magician. That's always good to get uh, big ticket uh, known uh, entities there. Blue eyes, dark magician. At least we're not getting obscure monsters. So that's nice, at least in terms of value, whether that's worth anything. Um, but it's cool to get, nice to add into the collection, keep his memorabilia here. 
So we got Rise of Salaman Great, Dino Wrestler Pancratops, uh, good card to play there. Salaman Great, Jack Jaguar. We got an Ultra Rare, good hit here on Thunder Dragon Fusion. Definitely not guaranteed in Galaxy Trance. We got Necro Fusion, Incantation uh, Pinsa Plume, Crusadius Spatha, Diaplex or Chimera to wrap out the pack. Flames of Destruction. Uh, probably a little bit of a weaker set here to get, but we can always hold out hope, pull a hit. I think these are going to be four from the back here. See if we can get Patrick going. And we might have just ruined it. F.A. Dawn Dragster. Uh, Elementor Ana, Yajiro Invader. We got Trans Familiar. We got three Trolling Trolls. Defrag Dragon. We've got Called by the Grave, uh, which is a fantastic card. Uh, saw somebody calling to have that one banned. Uh, and then we got Phosphor Age, the Elemental Lord, as the super rare. I think I saw an article on a TCG player that one of the persons, uh, one of the Ryder said that they need to add Call to the, by the Grave uh, to take it from one to um, either pull it up to three or ban it completely, which that's just a terrible move. All right, third box. Let's see what we get. First pack, Soul Fusion again. And we haven't gotten a Legacy pack. Cybernetic Horizon. I wonder if they're counting that as a legacy pack. And then we've got Pot of Greed. It allows me to draw three cards. That's what it do. Only two cards, but still. Um, <laughs> it's a classic. It's, it's a meme, guys. Let's get into Cybernetic Horizon here, see what we get. <laughs> That what it do, Yugi. Uh, just to see what see what we get here. We got Crusadia, Arborea. I feel like I should add that meme to things. Um, let's see, if we get Danger Nessie here. Beast Magic Attack, Mini Boral Dragon. We've got uh, Contact Gate and Wee Witch Apprentice as a super rare and Cyber Witch uh, as our rare in the pack. And then Divine Serpent, Performer Pal, and Cyber Dragon Veer. Let's see what we get from Soul Fusion. See if we can get another uh, Ultra. We've only got one Ultra today. All right, we got Predoplast. We got World Dino Wrestling. United Noble Arms are needed once again. Salaman Great Jack Jaguar. That's our second one of those. Herald of the Abyss is a super rare. We got Toll Hike. And then Diana the Light Spirit and Necro Fusion again. And Incantation Pencil Plume again. All right, last box. See if we get anything good. We got no duplicates on the pins thus far. And let's see if we can get underneath this plastic. All right, let's see if we get a, get a hit. We haven't gotten a legacy pack yet. At least not that I know of, not that I would consider a legacy pack. We've got Duelist Alliance, one of the advertised on the front of the box ones. And we've got Cybernetic Horizon again. So unless we get Danger Nessie, we're not getting anything uh, major there. And then we got Pot of Greed again. Allows me to add two Pot of Greed pins to my hand. That's what it do. Um, have to make the joke now at this point. Okay, let's see. Let's get that Danger Nessie. For the memes. All right. So let's get into these packs here. We're just going to go straight through because I've messed up the pack trick enough here. Crusadia Power. We got Drag Unity Legion. Drag Unity Chaos. We got Universal Adapter. We've got Crusadia Maximus as a super rare. And then Paladin of the Storm Dragon. Goki Tag Partner, Crusadia Leonis, and Crusadia Reclusia wraps us out there. Duelist Alliance, I think we got a short shot here. Get an ultimate, an ulti. Wrap us out. 
see if we get anything good. So hopefully the uh, box I didn't open uh, that one of you guys will win uh, will be the one that hits big. Uh, and if you do, you gotta let me know. We got Shadol uh, Squamata, we got Stellar Knight Alpha, we've got Hippo Carnival, we got Stellar Knight uh, Alsalm, and then Stellar Knight Altair. Or, yeah, I'm gonna go with Altair, like the Assassins. Uh, and then Artifact Chakram, Beast of the Wild, level five. We got uh, Nefarious Archfiend, Eater of Nefariousness, and that's six. So, all in all, card wise, Picks up, uh, pick up, you know, not fantastic. We did get, uh, we picked up one Ultra and Thunder Dragon Fusion here um, from back in uh, Soul Fusion. So our first Soul Fusion pack. And then we have four pins. We got two Pot of Greeds. We picked up the Blue Eyes White Dragon and the Dark Magician. Um, these are the Pin Club official ones that they released a few years ago. Uh, so they're cool. Probably will keep these in their wrapping, keep them sealed as memorabilia. I think they're pretty neat. Uh, I'll give you guys a little bit of a closer look here. Uh, let me know what you think about these. Uh, now that it is clear they are the official licensed product there. See? So that's, uh, that's a little bit nicer. It's not as much of a scam as it looks like on the face of the box. Uh, you know, they at least they gave you what was advertised. We didn't hit anything uh, in terms of uh, legacy packs, but hopefully on the box that's the giveaway here for you guys, you guys pull something great. Remember, subscribe, leave a comment, let me know what you think, and we'll catch you all in the next video. We've got uh, uh, Amazing Defenders coming up, and we've also got uh, Legendary Collection. We're going to do an opening of that. Uh, we haven't done that here on the channel, so we're going to bring that to you guys uh, here in the coming days. So. You guys take care. Catch you in the next one. Appreciate you guys watching. See ya.